Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. I am Ms. Rexon and this is Daily Rambles. Today we're doing The Flash Season 4, Episode 16. It's finally back from break. It's been forever, it feels like. So let's jump right back into it with uh, the episodes called Null and Annoyed. Null and Annoyed. Can't talk around Anyway, so we have Flash is doing a simulator, and Ralph is also there helping out, but he's kind of goofing off and not really taking it so seriously. And Barry's getting really pissed off about it. Then we cut to where, um, basically, Harry, or Harrison Wells, or Wells, whatever, is basically cracking. He's using that um, helmet a little too much, and he's starting to crack from it a little bit. And then, because he's starting to run out all the possibilities and stuff that the thinker's already done. And then we cut to where Gypsy's dad needs um, Cisco's help. And he was in a fight with vampires, and um, his power stopped working, so he did an emergency breach to Cisco. And so he can't vibe now. And then we have uh, the mechanic talks to DeVoe. And then DeVoe says they. Have only have a week until the host body shuts down, and so uh, the mechanic says she'll make improvements. And then uh, we have people trying to uh, move crate. I think Kevin Hart was actually, or Kevin Smith was in that. It looked a lot like him, and I'm not completely sure he was basically one of the movers trying to move uh, the crate. And so they would go to get a dolly, and then we have Noel comes in and makes it light. And then the people come back, and they notice that it's gone. And then the ship, um, well, the container drops, and she takes the crown. And then we have Cisco run tech, um, tests on Breacher. And then we have Caitlin says that he can't vibe it because of his age. And it turns out he's actually super old. He doesn't look it. He looks old, but not that old. And then we have the mechanic is working, and she drops her drink and sees a weird residue, so she uh, does a test on it. And then we have Team Flash got a hit on Null, so they go find her. Then we have Ralph versus uh, the skis ball, and impersonates Joe, with basically trying to be a good cop, bad cop with Barry. And then they run into Null, and then... Um, Barry tried to stop her, but uh, she literally just touched him, and he basically floated up to the ceiling. And then we cut to the um, effects uh, wear off, and he just kind of falls down to the ground at Star Labs, which was super funny to me. And then, um, uh, then we have Barry gets mad at Ralph, and then... Um, Barry's like just decides uh, to bench him because he's not following his instructions and stuff. Then we have the mechanic. It's uh, found out what was in the drink. And it's basically Weeper's um, meta stuff and basically makes you euphoric and in love and all this type of stuff. And she's pissed. And then we have Cisco. I uh, think um, of, of ideas to help Breacher and gives him some. Pills is best to help him with um, his powers, and it does work. And then he says thank you, and he leaves. Then we have Iris talks to Barry, and then while they're talking, um, they got another hit with Null, so they go to get Null. But um, he, well, okay, so basically Harry had an idea of basically. Uh, moving so fast that she can't see him with, um, move, he got to move faster than light, which I didn't know was impossible. And so basically they do that, and so he cussed her, but he didn't anticipate her having a getaway car that was floating up in the air. So he lets her go and, um, rescues the guy, and the car falls, and she escapes. But he does rescue the guy. Then we have Iris uh, tells Barry to uh, lay off Ralph and to basically just, you know, help him just try his way. It might actually work. And then we also have Wells is also getting a little bit out of control. He's like just beside himself. He's down himself because he can't think because he's not the smartest person, which I think is like an arrogant type of thing. Then Cisco buys Breacher and he's on the vampire planet. So he goes to bust him out. 
And then Cisco tells him the truth, and then he gets really mad, then he leaves. Then the mechanic records a video of herself saying, don't do it, don't trust him, try to escape, and save it under lemonade or lemon pie or some, some type of recipe with a lemon. And she gets busted by DeVoe, and it turns out... Um, She's been doing it. Um, this is like her. She's been doing the video multiple times, and DeVos busted it every single time and altered her memories. And then we have Barry talks to Ralph, and they try to talk it out and get more of Ralph's backstory. How like his dad left when he was a kid, and so they're both scared. Him and his mom. So he started cracking jokes, making her feel better, and eventually his fear left as well. So he kind of does just to cut the tension. And then they got another hit on Noel and is at a museum and basically um uh, so basically Noel gets Barry and he's floating up and Barry tells uh Ralph to take charge and he does. And so he handcuffs her and he falls fifteen thousand feet or 1,500 feet, sorry, I don't know, it was one, but it's one of them. <laughs> so he falls from the sky, because um, Noel got to him, and so he basically creates um, a landing pad of himself for Barry to fall on, and then it works, and then he passes gas. And it's like a slow, continuous gas, which was kind of funny. And then they talk some more after Noel's been locked up in the, um, the, not the prison, but where they were. Uh, if anyone's watching to this point, thank you so much. Anyway, it's in their jail, not the actual jail jail, in the pipeline. There we go, in the pipeline. And then we have, and so then we have Barry and... Ralph talk, and so they're um, get, they're getting along better. Then Breacher comes back and talks to Cisco, and he's officially retired and says goodbye. And he wants him to take his spot and offers him a job, and he'll be able to work with Gypsy all the time, and they will be like a duo. Then we catch over to Thinker is uh, playing the mechanic, and basically did the same stunt that she did last time that she woke up, and then. Go to where Harry enters uh, the basically that little chamber where the evil Wells was at, and suits up the helmet, and then talks to Gideon, and that's the end of the episode. So okay, so my thing is, first of all, I do like the episode a lot. I do love how the Flash incorporates uh, comedy, and it works very well, and it's well balanced in the show. So I do love that. But my thing is the mechanic is really smart herself and if she keeps on figuring it out, you would think the thinker would have a better understanding of how to handle her and not her just to keep realizing over and over again. You just keep on smacking her brain around and make it all goobly and stuff. Essentially if she's trying to create all this stuff, I I mean to me, that's not very smart on DeVoe's part at all. And I really think the mechanic is like a fantastic actress. So replace her, you're amazing, first of all. And then, um, I don't know, is this going to leave or not? I think that would be interesting if he does leave, but I feel like Harry is turning slightly evil now because he's trying to soup up. Uh, the helmet in order to help Team Flash, but I think that's going to alter him in some way. And because of some crazy cuckoo pants. And ain't nobody got time for that. So I really had this just like a one off thing, and I'm trying to make him evil or anything. And uh, Kevin Smith did an awesome job with this episode. I really enjoyed it, it was really good. But I'll probably give this a solid A. But I do like a bunch of elements in the episode, and I can't, I'm excited for next week. And I think that's wonderful for this episode. So, if you like this video, well, that does for this.
episode and video. So if you like this video, please give it a like. Comment down below. Tell me what you think of the episode. Do you agree or disagree? Just tell me what you think down below. Super, just super interested to know what you think. And if you also have any suggestions for any other TV shows or movies or music, just let me know also down below as well. Um, I've paused pretty much all my recordings. So for the ones that are done, those will be posted up in the coming days. I'm trying to get my desk straight. So anything I do, like a video for like TV shows that are coming like out right now. Of course, I want to do a video for it, but everything else as far as music and stuff is put on hold until my desk is straight. So anyway, that um, is what you know what's happening, and I'll see y'all in the next video. So just like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see y'all later. Bye, everybody.